My personal story in many ways is unremarkable um, to other first ones. I grew up uh, in the town of New Bedford. I went to school in a big urban school district. One of the things that is unique, however, was that I got the opportunity to be part of um, what was called the Talented and Gifted Program. This was my opportunity after the fourth grade to really carve out um, a special um, academic accelerated uh, curriculum. And that lasted all the way through high school uh, where I participated in the um, AP courses to the extent that my school offered them. My academic experience um, really uh, was one that was deeply gratifying for me intellectually and allowed me to really develop. Um, that said, um, it is also true, um, you know, that there, that I lacked for many um, examples for how to um, apply to, to college generally, never mind uh, some of the elite schools, which I was capable of, of, um, of attending and being successful at, uh, but was very clear uh, that I wasn't necessarily well prepared. So I had, um, you know, a random assortment of colleges that I applied to. And thankfully, um, you know, I ended up going uh, to a school that was local, uh, really, to me, uh, but a, a fantastic opportunity um, to get into MIT. Going to college and earning a degree uh, meant for me um, so many things. Number one, uh, it was an opportunity to really learn and grow and develop intellectually. Um, I think secondarily, it really was an opportunity for me to prove uh, what I was capable of. Uh, the work that you are asked to perform in college is uh, clearly something on a different order than high school. Uh, and it really challenges you to step uh, your game up uh, to be able to compete with people from all around the world. Uh, and in order to do that, there's just a lot that you need to know about yourself. Um, it requires you to reach deep uh, in many ways to continue to perform successfully. Um, and so being a first one carries a unique responsibility, uh, not only to self, uh, but also to the number of people um, who look to us uh, as first ones um, to really inspire them uh, to greater heights. And I feel that responsibility deeply, uh, that my life is not just my own, that my life uh, must serve as testimony uh, to those who may look at it and say, um, if he did it, um, you know, just maybe I could do it too. My name is Greg Shell, a managing director at Bain Capital, and I am a first one.